Hey guys and welcome to The Buying View. Hopefully you guys are all doing well. In this particular video, we're going to be talking about Brazo Hansalan, Han San Slamahimovic um, on his way right now to Italy. He might already be there by then. This was put up uh, by Christian Fox an hour ago. Uh, so uh, yeah, Brazo's on his way to Italy to not final. I don't know if it's finalised the deal. I think he's just trying to trying to complete the deal, trying to get it complete. You know what I mean? See where, see where the boundaries are, see where, you know. Because at the end of the day, you know, he's done some brilliant deals so far. Um, maybe he's playing for a new contract. We'll have to wait and see. Because remember, his contract is coming up soon um, in his um, particular position in the club. But yeah, um, without further ado, as always, uh, before we get into this, smash the thumbs up button. If you're going to enjoy, please do smash the thumbs up button. Uh, let me know what you think in the comment section down below. Comments will always be open on live streams, all the videos and all of that. Because... Um, you know, that's the whole point, you know, you guys and me, the buy and view collectively, let me know what you think. And if you are new, hit subscribe button. I think we're on 760 now, which is mind blowing um, generally. So we're getting closer and closer to that 800. It, it, it's crazy. By the end of the year, we sh we'll, we'll be on like 1.5 at this rate. You know what I mean? Like it's crazy. It generally is. So thank you for the constant support. But yeah, let's carry on. Uh, so yeah, again, um, coming from Christian Falk, obviously a very, very reliable source. Um um very close um to uh Bayern and um the Bundesliga in general. Uh so yeah, he's very, very reliable, top tier. Um Hansan Slamahim why can I never say his name? Hansan Slamahimovic or Brazo uh, is now on his way to Italy to, uh, for talks with Juventus around De Litt. De Litt asked Juve before the meeting to reach an agreement as he wants to go to Bayern. Um you know, I I can't say too much on it to be perfectly honest with you. I'm happy. Um, you know, this young lad wants to come to Bayern. I know some people are questioning him, um, being like, Why would you not want to go to Chelsea or Manchester United, you know, blah blah blah, Premier League and all of that crap. As an Englishman myself, living in England, you know what I mean? Um, that's just a, a crock of shit, to be perfectly honest with you, uh, that he's going to Germany for a, a easier road or whatever. You know, of course, some of the games will be easier, um, but let's not get it twisted. Most of the team, most of the time that we've gone against um, English teams, we've bl obliterated them. So let's not, you know, let's not take the piss here, you know what I mean? So, um, you know... Chelsea, Man United fans, whoever, they can talk well, as much as they want, to be perfectly honest with you, because the last time, last couple of times we've met them, we have absolutely obliterated them, so they could just pipe down. But yeah, um, other than that, brilliant. It's brilliant. Um, remember, Brazo obviously used to play for, uh, in his playing days, obviously he's now, um, you know, uh, on the board and all of that uh, at, at Bayern. But in his playing days, obviously he played for Bayern, but he also played for Juventus. So he's always kept that uh, respect. Uh, and I don't know if you would call it love, but um, to the point where, you know, he, he didn't leave there on a bad bad terms like Lewandowski probably is going to with us, you know. So, um, yeah, brilliant. I can't can't fault it uh, at all, to be perfectly honest with you. I'm very, very happy that we're going to be getting delayed. I believe he's, what, 22? 22-year-old. Uh, I know a lot of people are asking if that means um, Upamancano will be leaving. Upamancano had a shaky season, but he wasn't shit. No one near. You got to remember, he was coming from yes, Narguz, he was under Narguzman, um, but you know Narguzman didn't have what he has here. You know we've got the best striker in the world, no matter if he's leaving us or not. You know we've got Thomas Muller, various other players. You know Leipzig barely have anyone. You know if we if we're being realistic, you know, uh, and Kunku's only realistically come good recently. So um, yeah, let me know what you guys think though. Anyway, um, but yeah, just to clarify one more time. Um, uh, Brazo is now on his way to Italy uh, to um, for talks with Juventus. I don't know if anything will be uh, reached today. Uh, if there is any big update, I'll make another video on it anyway. But I don't know if there will be anything reached today. The personal terms have already been agreed. Um, you know, like wages and that. I think it's like eighteen million or whatever, uh, which was always going to happen anyway in this day and age. You know, what I mean, he's one of the he's one of the the big dons. You know, he he generally is. You know, he's um, too good for his age, like Kylian and. Mbappé. Mbappe. You've got to remember, Kylian Mbappe, look how look how young Kylian Mbappe is. And that's why he's going for that ridiculous money, because of how good he is, you know. So, um, yeah, I'm very, very happy. 
um, you know, it's it's been a good morning anyway, and then um, this news just makes it even better to be perfectly honest with you. So again, um, I don't think anything will be finalised. I'm not a hundred percent sure anything will, to be perfectly honest. The personal terms are done, like I said. Um, um, the videos there as well, if you want to go check that out. I think it would just be trying to reach an agreement with money and all of that, because remember, um. Delitz, Matthias Delitz, uh, agents, uh, obviously, uh, he was under Mina Riola, rest in peace, and, um, obviously Mina Riola's guys, you know, the business itself is, he's still under them, and they have stopped talks, uh, with Chelsea, and they put them on hold, because he only wants to join Bayern Munich, um, and also with, um, Manchester United, they tried to hijack the deal, or try and get in there, and got, basically got told to do one so um yeah take that as you will let me know what you guys think either way but if you know same thing with ryan gravenberch it's the same thing with Mane. you know people keep discrediting oh they only want to join Bayern. and what's that because of a an easy payday and easy this and easy that how many champions leagues have we won over the past 10 years you know what i mean like the don't even listen to the what people are saying because they're just talking out of their ass but yeah either way i'm happy you guys should be happy let me know what you think though either way smash the thumbs up button hit the subscribe button and until then i'll be back for another video later on today thank you for the cost of support and um have a great day guys